right, so we got this project car here, and what we did is we went ahead and we're working on the metal to show that there's absolutely no rust on this car. This car has never been in an accident. It's got the factory seams for the fenders right here. It has all of the factory spot welds all the way around all of the fenders, okay? And there's absolutely no previous accident damage. There's no rust anywhere. It had some surface rust on it, but we're in the process of cleaning all this up. We're going to treat the metal, and then we're going to put some epoxy primer over it. The headlight buckets have no rust holes in them. They usually get rust holes in the inside. They usually rust out at the top here or the mounting points where the headlights go. There's no rust anywhere. So we'll keep videotaping as we proceed. But this car is, the metal on this car is excellent. We've continued stripping this little 250 SL. You can see around the fresh air vent, there's absolutely no rust. We've put a special metal treatment on there. The factory seams are still here. So there's never been any panel replacement on this car. There's also absolutely no rust in this lower area here where these cars are prone to rust. A lot of them rust out right in here. All that looks good. So we stripped the rest of the fender down. We'll put some epoxy primer on there and we'll just tackle one little section at a time on this car. the rocker panels there's absolutely no rust the jack points are solid as a rock most of these cars rust out in the bottom here same thing in the back it's solid as a rock all of the original mounting plans is for the rocker panels for the rocker covers are here the door sill step plates are absolutely rust free and so is the door post and the back door jam. It's got the original factory, it's got the original factory left seam here. So absolutely no panels has been replaced. If you look in here, it has all the factory spot welds. Uh, so we got the passenger side door jam also cleaned up. Again, we got factory lead seams here. All of the factory spot welds are on the rocker. The inside of the door jam is all cleaned up. Again, all factory spot welds are in place. The rocker panel on the passenger side is as solid as a rock, just like it was on the driver's side. Absolutely rust free. It's amazing. So we've went ahead and stripped the rear fenders on this car. As you can see, all the metal is good. There's no rust. The rockers are good. Jack point is solid as a rock. There's no rust in any of the fender well lips all the way around the back. Most of these cars, they rust out around these areas. There's no rust anywhere. We found a little bit of rust on the other side, on the lip where the um, trunk seal mounts. The back is the same way. There's no rust in the lower panel. A lot of these rust out from here. Absolutely rock solid. 
Same thing on this side here. There's no rust. Usually these cars rust out in here. They'll rust out various places in here. This car is solid as a rock. Yep. All right, so what we've done is we've cleaned up these floors the best we could. And we're going to prep it with some special liquid. That'll prevent any kind of rust or whatever. And then what we'll do is we'll put some epoxy primer on it. We replaced we replaced one panel back here. We found a little bit of rust in the front floorboard, right in this area right here, which we can take care of that if somebody wants us to. And there's a little bit of rust on the other side. We'll show you that in a minute. Walk over there. But the floors are solid. There's no serious rust through at all. What we've done is we've taken out the number four fuse because the fuel pump on this car, of course, obviously doesn't work. The car's been parked since 1998, so it's spent 25 years in the barn. So we hooked up a temporary pump to the fuel inlet, and we rigged up a return into this jug here so we can see if it runs. And we know it runs because we had it running yesterday. So let's see if it starts again. belt is off the alternator. With the temperature gauge is working, the oil pressure gauge is working, the car's got good oil pressure, it doesn't smoke. 
Runs pretty good for a car that's been sitting for 25 years. comes with a soft top, the frame is in good shape, we lubricated all the hinges, it's a little stiff still but it all works, it folds down, good restorable shape, so that comes with the car, alright so we got a soft top frame that comes with the car, it's got a soft top on it but it's The soft top frame works. The top is actually not too bad, but it's it's yeah. But it all it folds like it's supposed to. All the hinges are good on it. Fold right up and down. Comes with the car. Also, we have a hard top that comes with the car. It's a complete hard top. Needs to be restored, but it's all there. All the glass is good, all the chrome is good. Also comes with the car. So we've got two tops. Car has air conditioning, automatic transmission. So what we got is a uh, project car that we found in a barn that's been stored for 25 years. It was stripped, and then it was just forgotten about, and taken apart. We went and rescued the car, and we sealed it up with epoxy primer. We also 
clean the floors. The car's got solid floors. Rocker panels are solid as a rock. It's an automatic, it's a 250 SO. Everything sealed up with black epoxy on the inside, gray epoxy on the outside. The gaps are decent on this car. This car has never been hit, never had any major panels replaced. It has all the factory spot welds. We have a video of it running. The compression is even all the way across. It has all of the factory spot welds all the way along the inner fenders. So again, no, no major panels were ever replaced on this car. We got a video of the car running. It will be attached with this video. We checked the compression on the car. The compression is even all the way across, right at 120 pounds. It opens and closes good. There's a soft top that comes with the car. And we have a video of it working also. All the hinges work, it's complete. Of course, it needs a new canvas after 25 years of storage. So it's ready for somebody to tackle. If somebody's looking for a project, We'll make you a deal. Give us a call.